Good morning, guys. Another vlog for 2021. I believe this is vlog 13. So we've been packing. We've been doing a bunch of stuff, starting this downsize. Roxanne's at work. I got a bunch of stuff that I need to do today. But so far, we've done quite a lot. May not seem like it, but it is. So I've packed up all my tools that I'm taking. I'm getting rid of these. This is old computers that I don't need anymore. Got those goodies. Here's our new generator. Pretty nice generator, I think. I gotta get a battery for it still. It's brand new. And yeah, I gotta go through this stuff over here. It's packed up and organized, but we're gonna move them all into um, those black and orange totes like that. I think it's just gonna be way easier to stack and, you know, when we move and stuff. So I had a refrigerator out here, got rid of that. It was broken anyway, that refrigerator was broke. And it is not a nice day today. You guys know I usually say, oh man, what a nice day. Nope. It is overcast and cold. And yesterday it started raining a little bit. Not a fan. Got rid of all these bricks that were on the side. I don't know if you guys remember from the other videos. I gotta do some yard work and clean up for when we show our house to uh, people that wanna buy it. I've been honestly like slacking <laughs> on the yard work. Pretty much since we got the trailer, I've been keeping it up a little bit, but I mean, the trailer and other things have they're just taken up too much of my time. So we still need to sell this couch. This couch. We are going to keep this picture because I love it. We're gonna keep these because a customer painted these and gave them to me as a tip for working. If we can swing it, we're gonna keep the outdoor furniture. Roxanne's been working her butt off doing all kinds of canning and she's doing a lot, man. She's done a lot of sauces, she's done a lot of different things. And uh, yeah. Ugh. So I got work to do today. Just wanted to fill you guys in on what's going on. Hey, one thing I forgot to mention, guys, my realtor suggested that we take out this fence. Um, this fence was not here at first, but I put it in because I didn't want the dogs to be running in and out of the front yard and getting out and messing up with the garden stuff. So I'm gonna have to rip that out too. But the cool thing about that fence is I didn't cement it down into the ground and I did that on purpose because I knew I wasn't gonna have this a permanent thing. And so this should only take me like 20, 30 minutes or so to get that thing ripped out. So I gotta do that today too. So got a lot of work to do. So let's get it. See guys, <clears throat> did not make it permanent on purpose. <laughs> I knew it was gonna come out eventually. And here it is, coming out. The problem is finding where all the screws are at. So now I can't find them all. There we go. Huh. One side of the fence fell over and is down. Good. Let's get the rest of it down now. <laughs> All right guys, as you can see, that actually only took me not even 10 minutes to do. I still gotta get the posts out, but it was very simple. Like I said, when I put it in, it was just to keep the dogs out of this area. And, and so we just have to keep an eyeball on them. But easy peasy, man. Like I said, I didn't even cement it, so. And worst case, I'll just cut them at the very bottom if I can't get them out, but I think they'll be able to come out, so. Our poor garden. You guys remember one of our first videos that died? No rain, literally all of 2020, except for like the first month. 
and it was barely like a couple inches. And then the rest of the year, not one drop of measurable rain, so. Hey, but you know what I think I'm gonna do with this wood, guys? <laughs> I think it's gonna go right over there into that fire pit, is what I think. Maybe we'll have a bonfire tonight. All right, let's get it. So like most of these, I don't know if you guys can see, I can probably just wiggle them, wiggle them and almost pull them right out. Actually, let me get this fence part out of the way. <clears throat> Cause I didn't dig them super deep. I only dug them like two feet deep guys. Look. And I didn't cement them. I put a little bit of cement, I think, in them, but nothing like permanent, just to help hold it on the bottom. Let me see. See? Boom. That's how I roll, man. At least for this fence, I wouldn't do that anywhere else. I think that last one's got a little bit of that cement stuff I put on the bottom. Now mind I didn't like fill it, I just put a little bit on the bottom to, so it won't sink into the dirt. I think it's still got it on there. So I gotta move all this wood. Uh, I'm gonna burn a bunch of it. But I got a trailer coming, I'm picking up tomorrow. Look at all this trash on my, my yard, guys. It's disgusting. But I'm gonna have to cut all this wood up. I have to cut it all up and make some firewood. So, moving all this stuff over here, because I'm gonna bring my saw over here and cut it and burn most of it. And why it's being a, a good helper, I guess. You're doing exercise now? Hey, you forgot a little piece of that sword right there. The stuff I asked you to pick up, you forgot a piece. I'm gonna put it on the on the with the rest of them. You got that hole filled up yet? Almost. Gotta do a little bit. There we go. I pull a root out. All right, moved most of the fence, um, but obviously this big piece, I'm gonna cut it in half. I'm gonna put it on the ground and cut it in half and move it. Easy peasy. Hi guys. This is our big giant trailer. That's actually huge. I'm only right here though, head lights. And 
That was a pine cone there. My favorite tree. Yum. There's one of the pieces. One of the pieces. Yep. Why don't you grab that other piece? Yep. Just kidding. It's too heavy. <laughs> so the only other thing I got left to do, guys, I gotta, I gotta clean this yard up. Obviously, you guys know that's what I'm doing. I gotta clean the yard up, make it presentable. Like, if you were gonna come by this house, right? Would you want to see like weeds everywhere? And, different things, right? So I'm probably gonna get rid of that little palm bush, that palm tree. Those things are horrible, by the way, guys. You might you think they're cool, but no. They're a nuisance. They're a horrible plant. And over here, that's where scorpions hide, that's where spiders hide. So I might just, just cut it and be done with it or make it look nice, right? Ain't nothing better than free firewood, I'll tell you. All right, guys. Well, I got done cutting this wood that I'm gonna use for the fire pit. Um, I got pretty much everything ready for tomorrow. This is all gonna be loaded up on a, a flatbed trailer that I'm gonna go pick up from my mom's house tomorrow. It's George's trailer, and she's gonna let me use it. And then I'm gonna load as much as it, much of it um, up as I can, including like this wood and different things around the house because we got to get it ready. You know, we got to we got so much stuff we got to throw away, and it's one of those things you don't do until you have to, right? At least I don't. Wyatt's over there playing in the dirt still. Still have a lot more work to do around here. This is just a little bit of the yard work, but it is looking a little bit better. I'm more happy with it. That's huge. Yeah, me and Wyatt just hanging out. How oh, what? Yeah. We're burning up the fence we took out today. And look who decided to crash the party. Ruin our man fun. Mom did not. Ruining our man fun. We had man fun all day until now. Now we have man and woman fun. Yeah. So we're going to chill. We're going to do chili dogs tonight for dinner. And french fries, right? French, french fries. Yes, I requested some french fries. Yep. So we're going to chill, guys. We're going to relax and do our thing. Roxanne's doing her thing already. It's Friday. It's Friday. You ain't got no job. You ain't got crap to do. Just kidding. See you guys in the next one. Bye.